welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Jasmine and welcome to my channel. Today, I'm going to be continuing my series and I'm going to be going over basic three and figure skating with you guys. So, the moves that you have to have mastered to pass basic three and figure skating are beginning forward stroking, showing correct use of the blade, forward half swizzle pumps on a circle, 6-8 consecutive clockwise and counterclockwise. Moving forward to backward, two foot turns on a circle, clockwise and counterclockwise. Beginning backward one foot glides, focus on balance. Backward snowplow stop, right and left. Forward slalom. And if you want to go the extra mile to make sure that you 100% your pass your basic three tests, you can do the bonus skill, which are forward pivots, clockwise and counterclockwise. I know that all this sounds confusing, but don't worry because I'm going to be going over all of these with you guys step by step to make sure that you guys know that by the end of this video, you'll be able to pass basic three and figure skating. So without further ado, let's get into the video. To do forward stroking, you're going to start off with your legs together, take the foot that you want to push with, turn it to the side like you're in a T position, and push off with the side of that blade. Then you're going to bring it back in, place it back together with the other foot, and then do repeat this process on the other leg as well. You also don't want to forget you want to push with an edge, not your toe pick. To do swizzle pumps on a circle, you're going to start by finding yourself a circle to do the swizzle pumps on, of course. You're going to start with your legs together, push one of your legs out to the side, and then you're going to bring it back. You want to make sure to stay on an outside edge with your gliding leg following the circle outline, and then just moving your outside leg out and back in to move on the ice. And then you want to repeat this on the other leg. And you want to do it six to eight times each leg. To do a two foot turn on a circle, you want to start off on a line. Then you're going to take a couple of half pushes. You're going to bring your feet together and rotate your body so that you turn. You want to keep your posture straight and it might be a little bit difficult because it's hard to turn at the same time as your body. But you want to try and keep your legs going with your body at the same time. So when you turn your legs, you want to turn your chest and your arms to follow them as well. And you want to keep your arms out nice and straight so that you can keep your balance. You also don't have to do this on the line. 
Each end of the rink has a half circle, it's colored blue, and you can do that over the top of it, or your coach will draw you a half circle to do it on. To do a backward one foot glide, you're going to stand on the ice with your feet together, take a push with the leg that you want to bring up, then once you're gliding backwards, you're going to bring that leg up with the top of your leg parallel to the ice and the bottom of your leg coming back into your knee like you're making a four. You also want to make sure to keep your posture straight and your arms out to the side nice and straight so that you can keep your balance. And you also want to repeat this on the other leg as well. To do a backward snowplow stop, you're going to start standing backwards, take one leg and push yourself backward. Then you're going to take the leg that you pushed yourself with and place it behind you gently onto the ice, not too hard because you might trip over it. Then you're just going to put some pressure on it and you're going to stop by making some snow onto the ice. You're going to repeat this on the other leg as well. To do a forward slalom, you can either do it between cones, or if you don't have cones, you can do it normally. I'm going to show you how to do it between cones first, and then how to do it without cones. So, you're going to lay out your cones in front of you, and you're going to start with your legs together. Then, you're going to try your best to glide through the cones. You're going to use your outside leg on each of the curves to push yourself a little bit. Don't bring your leg out too far, because then... They might count it as a half swizzle pump. So you're just going to push it out a little bit until you get some speed and you're going to bring it back in and glide diagonally through the cones. Now if you don't have cones, you're going to do the same exact thing. You're going to start and you're going to push yourself a little bit with your leg and then bring it together and glide diagonally through the line. Push your leg out a little bit and then bring your legs back together and glide diagonally through the line. You want to keep your posture nice and straight and your arms out to the side so that you can keep your balance. To do a pivot, it's pretty simple. You're going to take your one leg and put your toe into the ice nice and firm. Then you're going to take the other leg that is not on the ice and you're just going to push yourself around your toe pick. You want to repeat this both clockwise or counterclockwise. One side may be stronger than the other, but if you keep working on it, they will become equal. This is the end of the video. I hope that you guys enjoyed and that it helped you guys learn how to do basic three in figure skating. I want you guys to comment down below. Are you guys working on basic three or have you already passed basic three in figure skating? If you guys want to go check out the other two videos I made on basic one and basic two, both of those videos will be linked down below in the description box. 
Also, don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications. I love you guys. Bye!